guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a new video from my channel and it is going to be affordable finds. And everything that I'm showing you is under, I'm gonna say under $3 each, each. So I am definitely like a frugal, a f like when it comes to like everyday like little things, I have everyday little things, I try to be as like cheap as possible. Try to find things for a deal, so my parents taught me to go to the Dollar Tree, the 99 cent store, and my most recent love affair, Daiso, because Daiso is amazing. I'm gonna show you guys a bunch of the things that I have found at the Dollar Store, at the 99 cent store, or even at Daiso. I have beauty products, I have craft products, and I even have some like decor things that I found at the Dollar Tree, the 99 cent store, and Daiso. If you guys don't know what Daiso is, Daiso is a Japanese store and everything in the store, unless otherwise marked, is $1.50. So check that out. I'm going to show you a couple of things that I found at Daiso personally. First decor things that I found at Daiso, they are these little plants right here. And they're so cute. I found this little cactus at Daiso, $1.50. And then I also found like this little plant. I love these little potted plants. I think they're so cute and because I'm quite clumsy and forgetful, a lot of plants that I have, most of my plants are fake, that's fake, those are fake. I have plants around my room that are like definitely fake because I'm gonna kill them. But I found these, I found so many different styles of these at Daiso. They had a bunch of little succulents and cactuses, $1.50 for this little guy. And then these little plants, $1.50. They had this one, they had one that looked like it had like lavender on top. Oh, I have it right here. And then I found these. Look at how cute they are. Some of the other things that I found at Daiso, they have a bunch of different containers really. There are so many different containers that anything you could find there. One of the containers you can definitely use for pens or you can use for brushes is what I used to use it for until I switched over to something else. And one of the containers is this little guy right here. I think it's so cute and it's this little pencil case, pencil holder right here and it's just white. Can you see the details though? It's so pretty and it's it's white. It's got this little clear backing part so you can put pictures there if you want. And then it has, this is the always the side that I used to show for my brush containers because look at how pretty it is. Other containers that I found, they're jewelry little, jewelry trays. And jewelry trays at like other, at other stores, I've seen jewelry tra trays at Target or jewel, like little mini like ring trays at Target that go for $7. Sure, the pineapple on the top is cute, but do I need a $7 ring tray? N no, I don't think so. That's too much money. So you do have options that are, that are at Daiso if there's one near you. One is this really cute minimalistic one. It's this square little like pleather tray and it comes like this. It's very shallow and I have one on my jewelry tray and then one by my bedside table. So I love this guy, I think it's really cute and it's minimalistic, it's very clean looking and it doesn't, I usually have like makeup smeared all over my hands, but it doesn't, it hasn't gotten very dirty still and even then it's very easy to clean off, it's so cute and simple. I think they had this in like a brown and a black as well. The other little makeup tray or jewelry tray that I found at Daiso is this cute one. Everywhere else has like cute little makeup trays and they're always like five to seven dollars. I don't understand why they're so much when they're just like a little bit of ceramic and like this cute little topper. So whatever. But this one I found at Daiso. I think it's adorable and it's this little owl. Can you see it? Can you see it? I need to like block myself. It's an owl. You can't tell, but it's like this little gold owl on this like ceramic tray. It's got a, like a fairly small scalloped edge around the sides and it's so cute and $1.50, I definitely had to pick this one up. This one goes in my bathroom so I put my rings there when I'm washing my hands or when I take a shower. So that one's so cute and it was only $1.50. Not $7 like that cute pineapple one but I don't need a $7 little ring tray. A beauty thing that I definitely get a lot of use out of from Daiso is this guy right here and this it's $1.50 from Daiso. I've seen this on eBay or on Amazon for like $9. I don't understand how you go from $1.50 to $9, but 
This is a little pore mask. So you, it goes on black. It's very sticky when you put it on. And you just put it on, I usually just put it on like my T-zone right here. Or my nose and my cheeks because I have very large pores. And I use this, um, it's kind of like the Biore like nose strips. So you pull it off and a lot of like the stuff in your pores come out and it's just making it a little bit cleaner, you know? So at $1.50, I feel like this is a really good steal because these because those Biore strips get really expensive for like eight, eight of them. And then most other things that are like this get very expensive and I don't understand why. But at Daiso, if you have one near you, $1.50. Next thing, next thing I found at Daiso, I found at Daiso in their craft section, they have huge pieces of felt. They're usually like rolled up and you, you get so much. Okay, I'm gonna, this is like one of the ones that I made, so I can't like show you how much you get, but I didn't cut it down that much. So, honestly, this is how much you get. It comes up, takes up the whole frame. It's so much that you get in one roll of felt, and I use the this felt for like different craft things I'm working on. Obviously you can work on smaller things, but I was make, thinking of making this banner and it's adorable. And I obviously got the black one, the black felt at Daiso 2 and $1.50, I'm okay with that. And it looks like this, this is the one that I made. Let me step back, I'm gonna, and it says obviously Granger and Weasley and Potter and I'm a big Harry Potter fan and I made this by myself. I cut the letters out on my own and it's so cute. I can't wait to hang it up somewhere. But the felt was like $1.50 and it's such a great option for anyone who's crafting. If you have a Daiso near you, they have like a huge craft section. They got sewing things and buttons and amazing little things that you can add to your, your kit for your crafts. Other things that you can find at Daiso, uh, I found this chalkboard paint. And it's this color right here. It's this green color. And in my room, I had two different like black and white chalkboard frames and I didn't like the black because none of the the chalk that I had was like really showing up. I picked this up thinking, hoping that it would work and it's so tiny, you only get like 60 milliliters, but it was enough to do both the frames in my room and look at how pretty they turned out. I love the green, I think it's so great and I love the color and it's not like that stark black anymore so it looks so pretty in my room. Now, moving on to stores that you can probably find across the US, I have things from the 99 cent store. And this is like the everything 99 cent store, I want like the purple lettering. I have a couple things that I found at Daiso or at the 99 cent store that you'd, you'd be surprised that I found, I think. And one of them is obviously a decor piece, and it's this cute little succulent. It's so cute. They had a couple different options for this. This was a dollar. It's adorable and I bought a few of them but look at how cute it is. Even if you wanted to just take the succulent, this succulent is cheaper than the ones at Michael's so this is a dollar. You can take it out if you want. You can take it out if you want and then place it wherever you feel like. If you want to make like a jar one, if you want to do something else with it. But I do like this like little white ceramic that it comes in. I think it's cute. If you get little one like this at Michael's, it's like three dollars. It's like two to three dollars. This with this is a dollar. So if you buy a bunch of those, you're saving money, so why not do it that way? And check out the 99 cent store to see if they have any of these little succulents for you to use. Other things that I amazingly found at the 99 cent store are these Essie nail polishes. And I found them in, they had a bunch of different shades. They honestly have so much stuff that you have to really look through, but you can find some amazing things in there. And I found these Essie nail polishes. I have two of them. One is in Lil Bo, Lil Bo a Peep that I have on my nails right now. This is Lil Bo a Peep right here. And then I have the second, a second shade in Snake Rattle and Roll. They look very similar. But this one is a little bit pink, so it's so cute on my nails. For 99 cents for an Essie nail polish, I was definitely gonna pick up those. They had a blue metallic, they had a gold metallic. I think it was just like the, it's like a, a particular line from Essie, but I have found 
a lot of other Essie nail polishes at the 99 cent store. So definitely check it out for that. I found these this week at the 99 cent store. So make sure you look around for those. One of the other things that I found at the 99 cent store, I found recently this Zim's Crack Cream and it's a body lotion and it's citrus fresh. I think it smells so good and it doesn't leave my hands sticky or anything and I feel like they are really moisturizing my hands. So I bought a bunch of them because I just love lemon. I like citrus scents and it smells so good. And then lastly at the 99 cent store for crafting, I found so many things. They have but the things that I know every crafter needs. You need a glue gun and glue sticks. I've used this, this is almost like a year old I feel because I've been working on Rosie's Tahitian costumes for it's like two years. It's at least a year old and this has not failed me yet and this was 99 cents and the glue sticks I always get at the 99 cent store because they're so cheap. They're a dollar for this big bag and at, at Walmart I think they're like a dollar something but a dollar. It's a dollar. This is a dollar. I don't have to like worry about a glue stick or a glue gun because these are like my go-to's and it was under two dollars together together and I get a lot of use out of this I did use it on that felt banner that I made for Daiso so super affordable the last few things that I have are from the Dollar Tree and I found them they are a dollar so you have I was I'm gonna start doing meal prep I think so I have two options I have this guy which is a little sandwich container because the lid snaps off and it's just enough space for anything that I'm gonna make for a daily meal or for like a meal for the day. And then I have this one, it was a dollar, part of their spring collection that they're just putting out right now. And then I also have these guys and I like them because you're not gonna lose the lid and I lose things quite often. And I like them because they snap clothes, you can put they snap clothes, you can fill them up with whatever food that you want and then you just put them away in the fridge for a meal prep. They're both a dollar, so definitely check out the dollar store and the 99 cent store for your containers. These are great. I feel like they're going to be easy to clean and they're easy to put away because you can always stack them on top of each other. One of the other things I found is this little like bottle. I can use it for like juice when I juice or for smoothies if I'm going to make them. But I think it's so cute. It's part of the spring stuff that they're going to put out soon. So I love this. It's just adorable. It's like a 50 milliliter bottle, but definitely something that I'm going to use. But that is the end of my affordable finds video. I hope you guys saw something that you guys liked that made you kind of think you need to check out the Dollar Tree, the 99 cent store, and Daiso if you have one near you sometime soon. But I love those stores. I love going to them and seeing what I can find. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is my first affordable find, so make sure you give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, subscribe down below to see more content from me. But I will see you guys next time. Thank you guys again for watching and farewell.